Hello everyone and welcome to the Ultimate Gaming Channel. Thank you for joining me in today's video. We're gonna do decals showcase and I will show you all 17 that you can find in the game. So all 17 decals here as you can see. And I have them all now in my inventory. So I sorted them like this, white stripes, black stripes, animal stripes, retro stripes. Then we have the numbers, the wood panel and the camo. And then flames, floral, mural, weird wagon, sketchy, not today, shark teeth, arda, and then the year of the dragon and the sarcophagus. So all 17 are here guys. And I built the car all with the steel and all full new steel parts clean. And I removed everything else. I waited for the day, nice shiny day like this. So we can do this here. And I just added these tires to make the car looks better, right? So everything else, else is still. And just the reinforced headlights. So let's just start then with the white straps, guys. So I will add each, each decal on every part. So that you can see how it looks on each separate part. And then you can mix these how you want, you know, need to do this and wonder how it's gonna look because I will show you now. So let's start with the white stripes, okay? So the white stripes, as you can see, is just going to be, of course, the white stripes, right? And, uh, oh, I actually, <laughs> yeah, I tried to paint the gas cap okay now here it's going to be like this if i try to put on the steel bumper guys it's not gonna happen so you can just do doors and panels of course and these stripes are nice on this if you put black car or something like that then the white stripes are okay come on and the hood is left And now you can see, actually, can I add it to the whole chassis? Okay, and then you, if you select the chassis like this, so like the whole body, guys, then you can paint the roof also. So now you can see the white stripes looks like this, guys. So each part, now you see the back door. These back plates goes like that. Doors are just normal, and then here. So white stripes, not bad, if you want to have a black car like this, and then the roof, like this, of course. And here we are, yeah. Now for the black stripes, because the car is black, and it's just... When you just add the steel panels, I will just quickly paint now the whole car in white. So then... You can see the black stripes actually, because if I add them now on just the steel panels, you will not see almost anything, guys. So I will just quickly paint the car in white. And then add the black stripes, of course. So let's see. And don't forget uh, that you can also paint the chassis like this then it's gonna be whole car and now the whole car is white as you can see with the off-white paint right and if I now select but not the white stripes we need the black stripes now and it's gonna be the same as the white ones just the opposite of course so now if you want to have some uh, light colors on your car it doesn't need to be white like this you can put yellow or whatever some nice colors that you want then you can add black stripes like this and the car is then gonna look completely different guys this car you can spot much easily come on in the dark you know what I mean now with the black stripes, just the chases also. And, and now you see it's the same, just different, you know what I mean. Now it's white car with the black stripes. 
and the first one was the black car with white stripes so which one you prefer more guys I like dark colors more than light ones and now the next stripes are of course the animal stripes and I will try and add them on just the steel to see how it looks if you don't put any color and then it's just gonna do this so now you see the animal stripes it's like like claws are come on you know what I mean like some animal clawed the car and it's actually again not great with the dark car of course so now just on the foot and on the chassis of course now the whole car is covered with animal stripes guys but it doesn't work so well on the dark car so what I should do is just take the white paint no not the grey but off white paint of course just add it here now and let's see if I now again paint the car in white these stripes should stay right so now you see how it's how it's going to be if it's white car with the animal stripes or any other light color you know what I mean it's gonna be like this then now here is raining but it doesn't matter because each time I reload this it's always different weather and it's hard to make to always be nice and shiny I need to reload a lot of time and now you see when it's white car or with the light colors and you add animal stripes guys it looks like this I mean it's not bad but I don't like any stripes to use actually okay so now let's try the retro stripes again first on the just normal car without color and this one actually looks good retro stripes just on the steel without any color yeah sometimes this just do doesn't work I need to click a lot of times to make it work but it's okay now the retro stripes I think it's better uh, at least for me it looks better than this normal like black and white stripes you know what I mean look at the hood now and the chases what the hell is going on so that's it it's nothing on the roof and yeah so the retro stripes looks like this guys it's all covered like this at the back and then here and it looks actually nice the hood looks nice also so that's it from the retro stripes guys there's nothing on the roof just everything everywhere else on the car so now let's do numbers and just see how that looks like now again just on the steel it's always number 11 guys so if you want to have number 11 <laughs> anywhere on your car this is how it's going to look on each part so here is actually nice touch these stripes and then the number in the corner and here is actually the same and the other side is just mirrored but I'm showing you this so you can see how it looks on each part then you decide where you want to use it you know what I mean now again looks very nice on the hood let's see it is going to be on the roof also and now you see everything I actually like the numbers this one because if you add it here on the roof and on the front that's the best looking ones at least for me number 11 if you don't like that number then 
bucket, but uh, this is how the numbers looks, guys. And now we are going to do the camo, I mean the wood panels first. So let's see now if we add wood panels. On again, just the normal steel. It's just gonna turn them to look like it's from wood, you know what I mean. This is like a wood color. So if you like these kind of things, you can mix this with something else and then play the card how you want to look, guys. So now again, yeah, it's always stuck actually with the front and uh, and now you see chases doesn't work and uh, and here this I will try one more time but yeah so it's not working on the hood and on the roof you can just add wood panels on the door and here around the car and it looks like this guys so yeah, wood panels. I don't like them actually and I didn't use them at all. But this is how they look. Now so let's do a camera one now. Let's see how this one looks again, all on the steel. And the camo, similar as the wood one, is just gonna paint the whole car in this like military paint, you know what I mean? If you like to have your car colored like this, come on. Then you just paint the whole car with the camo one and you will have the military wagon, guys. Now you will see how that looks. Let me see, is it going to work on the hood? And now this one actually works on the hood and on the chassis. So you can actually make the whole car be in this camo color, guys. Now you see how this looks. If you want a military vehicle, this is how you do it. With the camo color, then maybe add some numbers or whatever you want to mix this with. This is how the camo looks. So let's start with the flames now, guys all the unique ones and let's see the flames now if you just continue to add up here it's just gonna add more and more flames and it actually looks nice you know what I mean flames are okay look at this here very good flames are very good to mix with something else and then if you color your car Again, the different colors, this can look much, much different, if you know what I mean. And on the hood, and now let's see the chases actually. And it's not gonna work for the roof, of course. But you see now, the whole car in flames actually looks very nice, like it's burning from here and then all around, you know what I mean. And here, I like the flames actually. I use them a lot, but not with the full car like this. But now you see how flames look like, guys, without any color added. So let's try the floral kit, guys. Now, it's hard for me to pronounce the floral, fro, floral kit. It's just the flowers, so if you like a hippie car or something like that, then you can mix these come on with something else again and make nice hippie car, you know what I mean I don't know why it doesn't work, always just click the button, you know but that's how it is so if you, know, if you like these nice flowers you can mix them with something else and then create nice car I mean and it works for all parts guys so now you see how it looks with the floral kit it's all just different colors flowers everywhere and it doesn't look bad so it's not any color here it's just steel 
everything is still again and this is how that looks so if you like flowers you can make this with whatever you want so let's do the mural kit now guys again all on steel so let's see now and this one actually looks very very nice it creates nice scenery you know what I mean so you can use this on each part separately each part is gonna create something else as you can see now so I like this one actually very much now the right side of the car is gonna be something totally different as you can see and the mural kit is actually very nice I like the mural kit now it turned blue when you light it like this it's very very nice let's try it on the hood and again yeah, it's actually a similar image as this one and let's try on the chases and again it's just added something small on the roof here and yeah this is how the mural kit looks like guys so again with lights a bit and it looks actually very nice so you can combine this again with whatever you want and that so let's do the weird wagon now that's next in line here and see what is this one going to create now again the weird wagon is going to be completely different on each part of the car as you can see so you can again mix everything with others and then create whatever you want so now you see this side weird wagon right with the flowers again the back door is going to have the flowers here and then the other part the other side i think is going to be the same so yeah this is just the weird wagon guys if you like again the flowers and these colors mostly green then you would like this one also and then the hood actually looks nice can we paint the chases also and just two more flowers on the roof now you see the weird wagon guys looks like this the best part for me is the hood actually and this on the side doesn't look bad but I don't know this is how the weird wagon looks guys so let's try now the sketchy one <laughs> I don't have the full kit but I think I can paint the whole car again with this so let's see the sketchy one I think this one actually doesn't work very well on this without paint but let's see yeah so it should be some white colors but I will paint the car now again in white so we can just see that so now you see it it's adding these like details around the doorknob and and it's actually now the I used it everything I don't know if I can paint the chases guys but uh, yeah let me just grab the white paint again and just see now how actually the sketch kit looks like when it's on some bright color you know what I mean so this is now the white color and the sketch kit guys I think it's gonna look much better now yeah it's gonna look like the car from some cartoon you know what I mean I mean now you see how it looks <laughs> like old and sketchy exactly that like all this is now and okay let's paint everything and now you see the sketchy guys the sketchy decal when it's bright colors like this then it looks like this so all white with the details 
And that was it from the sketchy kit. So let's try. Not today. Decal. How it looks on the steel. And it's just adding some kind of like. Oh, that's a Ghostbuster sign. So it works same as the number 11, guys. It's just gonna add this guy somewhere. Yeah. Like Ghostbuster guy, you know what I mean. So you can combine this again. Now you see how it looks on each part. It works the same as the numbers. I mean, same as the number 11. Because that's the only number that you can add on the card. And now here, yeah, this one actually looks very nice. Can I paint the chases? And again, on the back, big one. So not today. Same as numbers, guys. This is how it looks on each part. The best is on the hood, at least for me. And yeah. So let's do the shark teeth now, guys. Only a few left. But the last two are the best. At least for me. And now the shark is actually combining the first two. And this one you can actually add separately, you know what I mean? But this is uh, like combined. So lots of different messages, rabbit season. Let's see how it looks on the back door. So take flight and the guy. And now on the other side I... Let's see, is it going to be different? But it's not, so both sides are probably the same, yeah. But you can mix and match this again with something else. It looks very nice, this shark teeth, guys. And on the hood is actually not that great. And we cannot paint the chases, but on the side, now you can see how it looks when it's fully added to the car. So shark teeth, guys, not bad, not bad at all. I like this one actually. So let's do the other one. Now only three left. This is my top three decals. And now again, the Arda actually works much better on uh, on the car with bright colors. You know what I mean. But I will first now add it again, and then I will paint the car white. So just to show you how the Arda actually looks, because now only on steel. You can't uh, almost see anything, right? Because it needs to be some bright color. And the sign on the hood, very nice. Can we paint the chases? And we can't. So now, because it's actually not great visibility, I will just grab the off-white paint again and paint the car white guys so now you will see how this will change and how it actually looks right when you apply some uh, bright colors like the white one come on so here is just this sign and everything else is white so it's actually the letters and the name of the this company in game, Arda. And just this. And the chases. And now you will see this Arda kit. I mean Arda decals. This is how it looks actually when it's on some uh, when it's on some this like light light color, you know what I mean? Bright. This is how it looks on the hood guys. And yeah. So let's do the Year of the Dragon now. And let's see on the steel panels. 
I think this one again works better when it's some light colors, I mean brighter than this and it's a dragon I mean here is not some kind of clouds or whatever this is but I think it's going to be the same on both sides, just a big dragon and I will again paint the car in some in white color to just show you how it actually looks come on and this here looks very very nice as you can see it's the best to use it on and actually we can paint a little bit of roof also just adding these lines and now you see how it looks guys when it's without any color just on the steel on the steel package year of the dragon right very good very very good but i will grab the white paint just to show you when it's car colored with some kind of bright paint right then the dragon will be seen more as you can see now it's totally different and let's just paint the whole car now white just to show you here is going to be the same but you always want to see the full car of course to have the best look of everything now come on and the chases of course and now you see the dragon the decal dragon decal kit and it's on some like white color or some bright colors like this again looks very nice but that was the year of the dragon guys and let's try the sarcophagus now guys that's the last decal that you can find in the game and this is very bright one so you don't need colors I mean you don't need to paint the car you will see how it looks on just the steel panels and doors it's the same on both sides as you can see but this one actually not that great least not for me and then here is actually the best part I think let's try to build to paint the chases and yeah actually not bad this decal now when I see how it looks when it's full yeah very very actually bright bright colors I like this psychedelic like you know what I mean if you eat mushrooms and things like that you will paint the car like this guys and this was the sarcophagus decal kit we will end it this video with this so if you like what you see please consider liking subscribing and commenting guys and join me in another Pacific Drive video I want to just add that I show you all this on the steel parts and the best is actually to put all these on steel crude armored or the olympium ones because then you have clear doors like this if you put insulated or something like that lead plated and it's not gonna be exactly the same as it is now because those parts have additional things added on doors and on the panels and then it's not it's not gonna look clear like it's now you know what I mean and that's all what I wanted to say actually so again if you like what you see guys consider liking subscribing and commenting and again thank you for watching and join me in another Pacific Drive video